Good evening. Good Everyone. evening. Welcome. Okay, people, welcome back to your class number eight. So tonight we're going to continue with the marketing mix. Okay, marketing mix. Remember that the marketing mix is uh, made up by four um, elements. And all of them start with a letter P. They have P initial. So this is why we know the marketing mix um as the four piece right four piece and they or oh, this four piece stands for product price place and promotion okay and the way that you mix all of them and the, the importance that you assign to each one it's going to determine the success of your sales or at least your um uh, the success of your company or at least your group of sales right your people your team so it will depend on how you manage this for peace um that's going to determine the success of your team, the sales team, okay, the sales team. So now we are going to continue with that. Just remember that when we started to study this, um, it was with a purpose to know the vocabulary related with it. Mm. We are not marketers. We are not, um, a, we don't have the expertise, right? Maybe we are knowing this in a general context, okay? Not a specifics, but basics, all right? Basics. So it is important that we focus this uh, not in a technical thing, but in a common and an everyday a knowledge okay everyday knowledge so it is important for us to know this because of our workplaces environments maybe our companies offer a product or a service and we are part of these mix okay we are part of this mix it's um we are a very important part yeah in our offices, maybe we are assigned to some responsibilities to in the middle, right? Or in the process to acquire profits, to get profits, okay? And our companies will be prof profitable at the 
pays we are selling or we are collecting the money for offering the services or for selling our products, okay? Well, people, mm, let's start then by presenting the topic and the object. Okay, then welcome everybody again. Thank you very much for being here. This is your class number eight. And today we are going to do an analysis. We are going to analyze a national product and we will mm, check their pricing strategies. Okay, their pricing strategies. This is in the mix or how they manage the marketing mix. Okay, how they manage the marketing mix. So we're going to do some research, but at the same time, we just want to talk about experiences with any kind of product that we have uh, tried or that we used or uh, used to buy, used to acquire, because this product fits your needs. Okay, uh, so um, this is the the topic today and the objective is that one, okay? Analyze, analyze, right? Analyze, what is to analyze? It's to observe, to define, to describe, that's to analyze. The components of the product and price strategies of a famous national product or service. So this is our class number eight. Okay, so we want to analyze the components of the product and price strategies of a famous national product or service. It could be a product, it could be a service, depending on your own experiences and what you want to share with us. This is our... Um, Class agenda today is class number eight. Agenda. All right. And we want to do our feedback. And we want to talk about the marketing mix vocabulary. Then we're going to role play the conversations as a manner of getting the um, structures or the template or samples how to express yourselves talking about the marketing mix, okay? Then we want to uh, review this and also I will give you some assessment after your presentations. Then uh, in the session one-on-one -on -one tonight, Elias will be the one uh, to do your questions, okay, in your 10 minutes. So Elias Neftali, it's your turn today to stay after the class, 10 more minutes in your session one-on-one. -on -one. So prepare yourself, all right. Now, let's go and <clears throat> talk All right, guys, let's talk about some products in the market. This is because the mix of marketing or the marketing mix has 
four P's, right? We have product, price, place, and promotion. This four P's uh, become your marketing plan, okay? They, the strategies that you create or that you um, establish with your marketing team, uh, it's going to be or it's going to become your marketing plan. And a marketing plan is like the register or that you put by written what you are going to do and the goals that you want to achieve. The most important goal for a company will be to make profits, right? To sell the product that we produce. Maybe my goal is not only to produce something, but my goal could be to feed the needs of my a target market, but at the same time, it has to be profitable, okay? This idea has to be feasible too. So this is why we need a marketing plan, like a roadmap, right? To follow and to get, okay? To start from point A and get to achieve my goals. So that's why we need to implement a marketing plan. And the marketing plan contains these marketing needs, the strategies that you are going to use, okay, to offer a product, for example. Yeah. Uh, the strategies that you are going to use to uh, promote or to make this a uh, product uh, acknowledgeable, right? To people, how you are going to take your product to these people or make it uh, available for them to buy it or, uh, or for you to sell it. Maybe you are going to do it in a physical uh, facility, or maybe you can get uh, your, you can establish your uh, place through devices, right? Or through internet or online, right? It could be that your product is software. So it's, is it going to be downloadable or what's the way you are going to offer your product, the place where you are going to make it available, but also how uh, will be the way for people to know your product, okay? How people is going to get to know your product, the features, um, the prices. So all of that is your marketing plan, contains your marketing plan. Strategies for your product, strategies for your promotion, strategies for the place you are offering the product, and also, the um, uh, prices, okay, the pricing strategy. What do you think it's going to be um, the best mix? Is it important to focus in a product strategy or is it important to focus in a pricing strategy? What do you think, guys? What do you think? What is more important? to focus on when we are mixing all these elements to create a marketing plan. What do you think? Well, well, I think the marketing plan is important to the product in the branding too and the in the offer uh, because the people uh, can can buy this product in the future or or in this or in this moment um, because because this this country the the prices is very expensive 
uh, the all companies uh, try to try to think the the prices the low prices because the situation is here very very hard in this moment okay uh, yeah because of the crisis right economical and finan financial uh, crisis from the government and all the macroeconomy, right? So yes, you're right. But uh, what do you think, guys? Alberto says uh, these are very important points, right? When you are thinking or creating your marketing plan, okay? You have to be aware of the um, environment situation, like economics, like the um, if it is easy or the feasibility of offering and acquiring a product, right? So yes, it's really important to get this in consideration, right? Like social aspects, right? The, yeah, mm -hmm. but also it's important to uh, have a, a this uh, product. Mm -hmm. And also prices, a strategy, mm -hmm. uh, uh, and to to have a good uh, quality of product or the packing on the uh, mm -hmm. yes on the okay. other exactly there are many important things okay. Yes, you are right. It's not only the social things, it's not only the mm -hmm. economical things, but what but you can see are if you needs. have attraction, attraction price and attraction, huh? cost, exactly. cost, uh, cost benefit. Yes, so. but any activity that we make in a company uh, has the objective of make profits okay make profits it's not correct you you are not going to create a company for it is a social, losing social, money to social uh, meaning uh. yeah yeah mm -hmm. okay then the marketing mix uh includes the product the price, price. the place yes. and the promotion okay Perfect. what is a product what is a product? It's a good that uh, uh, people need to uh, satisfy uh, uh, the life or uh, the the, the I necessities. Don't know yes. Needs and necessities. Okay, good. I need, mm -hmm. need necessities, right? Yeah. yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Good. Mm -hmm. And uh, what about the price? What is price? What is that? Can you define price? What is price? Is the cost the the product for 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 acquisition of the products? All right, good, good for the acquisition of a product. Yes, and also is the amount okay. of money that you collect when you offer a service. Okay, so yes, exactly. That's price. And price has to be seen in different ways. From the point of view of my company, from the point of view of the customer, and from the point of view of the, um, the production, okay? The production. Yes, the cost of production. Because we need to include that in the price if we want to make profits, okay? So we yeah. need to see this in three points of view. Okay, what about the plays? Plays. What do you think this term is referring to? Plays. Is. Is the ubication. Is a, market, a supermarket. 
Okay, a supermarket is an example of a place where they sell products and where you can get any product. Okay, like groceries and households, right? Or maybe things of everyday necessities, right? So, uh, Ana Lorena, you were saying something too. Yes, teacher. Uh, for me, is the ubication that uh, where the client can find the product. Uh, All right. Is depending of the product uh, also. Okay, good. Or to push us, to purchase the product. To purchase, okay, good. To purchase the product. Okay, to buy, to get, to purchase. To, buy, to get, yes. Okay, good. And yes, that is correct. Um, also, let me tell you that it's not only the physical place. Okay, it doesn't refer only to a physical place. It refers to all the activities that you do to make a product available for the customer to buy it, okay? So it's not only the place, the physical place, because there are some products that, we do, that are not offered or are not available in a physical place, right? Maybe it could be online, right? Or uh, it could be, just deliver to your house okay you just uh request or you order the product and then they deliver it to you maybe the place is just the production place or maybe the place is just a storage place it's not a um display or a store it's not exactly that in some cases but in general a place is where you put available or you make available the acquisition of any product or how to contract any service, okay? How to contract any service. All right, what about promotion, guys? What about promotion? Can what be the think? offer, can be the offer. Okay, it can be the offer. The offer like mm -hmm. uh, referring to a price? Uh, the price and add a product and add service can be can be a lot of things okay promotion yes uh in this case it's not only limited it's not limited to prices it's not the promotions that we know in spanish okay in spanish we know that a promotion it's just that you are going to get two by one, okay? You pay only one and you get two. It's not referring only to that, okay? This is referring to, exactly, yes, advertisement and how, or the strategies that you're going to use to communicate why your product is in the market, okay? Why? your product exists, okay? What's the purpose of your product? And at the same time, you are going to promote the prices that you offer, okay? It's, uh, the price will, be, will become a characteristic of your product when promotion is in the play, right? So in this case, it's not only the price, is to make acknowledgeable to everybody or to my, market or my target market the product that i offer the product that i produce okay or the service that I, that I offer so it's the way that you are going to use it's not only way but media okay social media it could be the other types in this case of um, ways to communicate right it could be written like press, right? Or maybe TV, radio, and well, those are the biggest ones and they are being uh, replaced by the social media that they are, in this days, it's, uh, it has become, became like, I'm sorry, it has become um, like the new um, media priority, right? So. Sure. Tell me. Uh, for, for example, in my company, uh, uh, I create a department uh, specific the promotion in internet. 
and, um, and his name is the Omni Canalidad. He, uh, it's the promotion and sales full internet as an specification. He okay. is uh, in the marketing is um, a new department. Yeah. Okay, good. Online sales, right? Online yeah. sales. And this is a completely different area. Okay. You need yeah. to have uh, to create a new um, route of distribution of the product by delivering it, by well, play, uh, making the product available in different ways, not just in a physical place. All right. Yes, good. Mm hmm. And they do it all, everything online, right? Transferences, uh, bank transferences, and uh, it, I mean, there are other elements involved in the online digital or this kind of marketing. E-commerce. E yes. E-commerce, that's correct. That's the new, that's the new place, right? Or it, it becomes like, uh, well, the new way, right? The new way. It's a new era <laughs> of marketing. Um, even though it's not so new because it's already established and the pandemic contributed to uh, this e-commerce uh, way, okay, to grow, okay? So it contributed. Okay, then now let's think about the aspects or the elements in each strategy, okay? Because we want to see a product like a product strategy, okay? Product strategy. In a marketing plan, we are going to see the four Ps like strategy. Why? Because we want to focus all the elements that we are going to work on to uh, offer a product or make this, pro this process profitable. Okay, so let's see about the product. What is, I mean, what will be the first strategy or the first focus or point of view? I mean, a thing that Maybe we are going to plan. Mm -hmm. A brand name and design. Okay. Brand, design. Design, mm -hmm. unpacking too. Packaging. Yes, packaging. Packaging. Mm -hmm. uh, packaging. packaging. Packaging, yeah, all the package, right? The package. Yeah, packaging. Mm -hmm. You have packaging. to decide if you are going to sell the product by pair or maybe you are going to sell the product by dozens or yes. you want to sell the product in a package of, I don't know, 25. Uh, a small I mean, one or a or, or big one, liter or a... Exactly. A liter, yeah. The okay. presentation, right? It the quality, be... if you have the economical or if you have the premium thing or yeah. specific um, products for specific needs. So, yeah. yes. So, that's quality. Quality, okay? Packaging. As I said, it could be plastic in a bag, in a bottle, on glass or uh, paper, right? Wrapping paper, what kind of colors you are going to use in your packaging if you are going to add your logo in the front or in the back or if you are co-branding, where are you going to locate your, um, your elements, right? Your elements. So yes, in the product, we are going to think about the design, the packaging, the quality, and of course, the name of the product, okay? And the brand under which one we are offering the product, okay? What's the backup, right? So let's see about the price strategy. Pricing strategy, why do you think product and price strategy is important? What do you think? If we make only one strategy and we convert this product and pricing all together uh, as a strategy, let's see, for example, retail price. As I was saying, I can package the products by twos 
or maybe I am doing this by mm -hmm. dozen, right? So if I'm going to sell these with uh, discounts or payment plans, right? Like installments, if I'm, buy, if I'm selling a house, okay? If I'm selling different kind of um, products like luxurious, or if you are offering other products like, um, I don't know, designer brand uh, products, right? Uh, like exclusive ones. Yeah, so you are going to offer maybe payment pl payments plans, or if you are going to do it by any credit term, right? And you are going to decide also they, um, policies right the policies yeah like the return policy like the um, a refund policy okay um you are going to see the guarantee okay, for the price they are paying if you're going to add a guarantee or if it is included in the price right so we need to discuss this in our marketing plan uh, in order to make uh, the profits that we are expecting to get, okay? This doesn't have to abstract, it has to sum, okay? So let's see, retail price, discounts, payments, plans, credit terms, or maybe you are going to offer, like if you sell by in a retail location or for wholesalers, it's going to be also by the product and the price determined, right? A determination, because uh, if you sell something in bulk, the product in bulk, then we are talking about wholesalers. And if we talk about the wholesalers, we are going to offer not a retail price, we're going to offer a wholesale wholesaler price so everything is like in a chain right and one determine the other and the uh, one affect the other so we need to do this mix very carefully in order to get profits right so let's see about the place because in the place we i said that it's about the activities you do the activities you do to make the product available. Uh, so it means that are you importing or are you uh, importing the raw materials? What are you importing, for example, if you are importing something? Um, maybe in the place we're going to Say if we are just distributors, it's, uh, it's not going to be the same as if I am the producer, okay? So we're going to see like the distribution is really important when we talk about the place. Okay? As, I, uh, as Hosman was saying, uh, the delivery of the products will become like the most important thing in the online service, right? In the online sales. Because if you do not offer a very good customer service in the distribution or in the delivery of the product to the final consumer, then maybe, maybe you are not going, you're going to lose money, maybe. Okay, so that's why I wrote here the delivery, okay, delivery processes, delivery systems. Okay, it could be also outsourcing. You can contract a different a company that it's a, they have the expertise of delivering. Okay, they dedicate just to that activity and they know how to manage that part. Okay, maybe I'm not I'm not so expert, but they are. So I trust this process to another company. So this, uh, when we talk about place, as I said, it's not only the facilities, okay? It's the activities we do in order to put the product in the hand, okay, of the customer. Okay, downloads, as I said before, if it is music, 
software, any other kind of products like books or newspapers or magazines, whatever it is that can be in a file, okay, in a file, then are you offering this downloading the product? Okay, if they pay a price for it, okay, then you have the product, then you have the price, now you have a place. It is online, you can get it right from the device because it's a file, downloadable, okay? Now, let's think about the promotion, promotion elements here, advertising, public relations, Public relations not always is paid, okay? Not always is paid. Um, you can get public relations um, making, creating news, okay? Creating news, being the news. Um, the personal selling, for example, personal selling would be like um, that you... Uh, create this strategy to visit door by door, right? Knocking at any door. So it could be personal and, or mm, you create teams to uh, sell my product or your product person to person, okay? Also, it could be digital marketing as uh, Elias said, e-commerce, right? But that's a, completely um, a specific activity, okay? And it has its own strategies, okay? Its own strategies, but it can be considered as a part of my business plan, okay? Of, as a part of my marketing plan. Remember that my business plan and my marketing plan has to be hand by hand. Um, one second, please. All right, so these are the four P's, right? Product, price, place, and promotion. So, uh, product, price, place, and promotion. Those are my elements in my marketing mix. But what does a marketing mix do exactly? Okay. Let's define what is marketing first, okay? Let's define what is marketing. Um, okay, with the knowledge we've got at this moment, let's define marketing in only one word, okay? Let's define this a activity of the company, marketing in one word. I will give you, one second. A code and you are going to introduce, in the entry you are going to write just one word that describes what marketing is, okay? Have you ever done Mentimeter? Mentimeter. Do you know Mentimeter? Yes, I do. Thank you. Okay, this is the code. I will copy the link. I will send it through the chat. Or you can do it by going to www.menti.com 
and you use the code 4462-6162. In the Google search, go to www.menti.com and you introduce the code 4462-6162. If you can't reach it, then click on this link I sent right now and through the a Zoom chat. What is marketing? One word. You can participate three times. So you can use three different words. Could you do it? Mm. Hello? Yes. I uh, I seen the the page. Uh, I enter the page and in the what is marketing. Mm -hmm. You write one word as an answer. What is marketing? Okay. Thank you. Okay. Yes, it's a process, right? Mm -hmm. Activity. Okay. Offer. Offer will be with uh, without the letter T. Okay, like it. It will be offer. Technique. Mm -hmm. Advertising. Offering. Mm -hmm. Knowledge. The activity of business, mm -hmm. sale, to sell a need, okay. To earn money, demand, business. Mm -hmm. Communicating, very good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
market research to earn money. Attracting, the letter R is missing. Letter R is missing. But yeah, attracting. Service, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, market research of offer, offering. Acordémonos que después de preposición, okay, vamos a poner ing. En este caso también, for selling, of offering. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Attracting. Solo ocho han participado. Vamos, vamos. Okay, I will stop sharing. We read all of your words, okay? And now we're going to define what is marketing. What is marketing? Let's try to create a definition, okay? Let's try Did to... Mm -hmm. Assist assistance. Attendance. 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 Yes, I'm going to call the roll, but just give me one second because I don't want to lose the words that you wrote in the Mentimeter, okay? Vamos a ver, ahí les envié la imagen de lo que ustedes escribieron ahorita. Con esas palabras, tratemos de armar una definición en este momento. Vamos a ver. Una oración. Vamos. Subject, verb, and complement. Subject, marketing. Verb, is. Now, the complements. A ver. Vamos a ver. Eh, Kevin Alfredo. Yes, teacher. Um, I think that marketing is a technique that the company used to earn to earn money. Very good. To earn money. Mm -hmm. To earn money. Good. A ver, um, Miss Ana Lorena. What is marketing? Marketing is a process with strategies, strategies for offer the product to the client. Very good. Very good. Elias Neftali, what is marketing? Um, for me, marketing is the offer and, and the demand. All right. And Hosman? Okay. Uh, marketing is a process and a strategies uh, for offer the product. To offer, to offer the product. Okay, yes, very good. Cuando decimos un propósito, 
usamos un infinitivo completo, to offer, ok, to offer. Y si, y después de eh, cualquier preposición como of, eh, como for, okay, tenemos que añadirle ing al verbo, ¿sí? En este caso, to offer no es una preposición, no está fungiendo como una preposición, sino que como una, la otra parte del infinitivo, ¿verdad? Entonces sería to offer. Yeah, too often. Very good. Thank you very much, Hosman. Okay, people. So I'm going to call the roll and I want you to say one word that describes what marketing is when you say press. Okay. You can also uh, tell me one of the elements of the marketing mix. Okay. Well, while I, when I call your name, when I call your name, you will say a word that describes what marketing is. Remember the requirements from Insta Forb. Please turn your camera on. We want to see it's you, the one it's behind that camera or in front of camera, right? In front of that camera. A ver, people, please. There you are. Very handsome, Elias. as well. Good. Let's see, guys. Please turn your camera on. There we are. Very good, Boris. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, Kevin. By the way, guys, what date is it today? What date is today? Wednesday. Wednesday? Yes, today is Wednesday. My 24th. 24th. May the 24th. Yeah, May the 24th. Y eso suena como May the 1st. We'd be with you, okay? <laughs> yeah, May the, May 24th. the 24th. Yeah. <laughs> okay, <laughs> there we are, guys. Álvaro Ernesto Aguilar Peñate. Here I am. Okay, can you tell me what marketing is in one word? Uh, marketing in one word? Yes. Um, um, advertising. All right. Thank you very much. Ana Lorena Lobato Orellana. It's a process. All right. Very good. Thank you. Boris nice Alexander try. Cortez Cáceres. Uh, it's a. Nice It's activities. Okay, good. Thank you. Carlos Alberto Dominguez Martinez. Process for creating. The process for? Creating. All right, creating. Okay, good. Eh, Carlos Ernesto Hernández Cepeda. Edwin Antonio Quintero Sumaña. Eh, it's uh, an strategy. Very good. Elias Neftali Martínez González. Offert and demand. Very good. Eulice Torres Torres. Fátima. Okay, Fatima Noemi Umaña Castro. Jose Miguel Torres Hernández. Jose Salvador Bernal Quintanilla. Osman. Okay, Salvador, thank you. Osman Atilio Serrano. Estrategis. Very good. Karen Isette Sánchez Castro. Uh, 
Kevin Alfredo Lucero Menéndez. Is a technique. Okay. Nelson Alberto Peraza Mejía. Rafael Alexander Serna Díaz. Present advertising. Okay, great. Santiago Roberto Calderón Avelar. Uh, for the purpose of selling. Okay, good. And Wilber Alberto Perez Mendez. To sell an either. To, okay, good. To feel a need, all right. Okay, people, so in this moment, we want to think about why, I mean, what exactly a customer wants from a product. What do you think? What exactly customers are looking for in the product that you offer or at your company offers? Yesterday, Kevin gave us an example, okay? Now, tell us. One second, Elias, come on. Lower prices. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. the, the product, I think the product is uh, low prices and quality and high quality. Okay, good. Mm -hmm. A accessible prices too, right? Mm -hmm. Accessible because sometimes maybe people don't want exactly something cheap because they consider that that cheap is not good quality okay so if you have like a middle price or something with good quality in an accessible price then you are going to get the market okay you are going to take up all right so um, According to that, we need to describe what exactly then would be your market, okay? Because we say the marketing mix is, a ver, de lo que vimos ayer. Okay, let's go back to the conversation we read yesterday. Do you remember what this team in the conversation said? about what the marketing mix is. Do you remember? So it's uh, uh, putting the right product in the right place in time. And the right promotion, right? Okay. At the right price, okay? At the right price. So the four Ps have to be right. Okay, right. You have to consider all the aspects related to product, place, promotion, and price. So let's think about some products mm, we have in the market. If we think about coffee, okay, let's say some brands. A ver, let's say some brands of coffee. Can you give me examples? Uh, All right. Good. Coffee, coffee. Okay, good. Mm -hmm. Mahada Oro. <laughs> All right. Uh -huh. According to your needs and according to the way you use this product, you think about a brand. For example, you think about uh, like Elias, Nescafe. Why? Because I prepare this in the morning, okay? And I need instant coffee. And maybe another person would, would think about coffee like post cafe because they love the cost cafe. I mean, mm. boiled, okay, boiled. And in the, or maybe in a coffee maker, okay. So mm. according to your needs, to your custom, customs, and also to your um, habits, you will think about the product the way you use, okay, the way you need. Um, some people could think about Starbucks, some people could think about the coffee cup, or just La Niña Mercedes in the corner, right? So um, we're going to think those uh, with the big uh, back box they've got, the tank, the water tank, 
okay? Boiling water tank. And then they offer these with cremora, okay, or cream, um, yeah, non-dairy cream and sugar. And they offer that for 25 cents, right? I don't know how much is the price right now of a, a cup of coffee like those, but uh, according to your needs, you are going to think about a coffee. Now, but depend uh, depend to mm -hmm. the purchasing power, no? Yes, of course, of course. So the it, I mean, it's included in the, in your needs. Okay, the price is included included in your yes. needs. For example, I was going to put this an example as an example. When you go to Hospital Rosales, you see a lot of people selling different products around the hospital, right? You see people, or if you go to Maternidad, right? You see a lot of people offering different products that people inside those buildings really need, okay? They really need those products inside. So it's a market that it's already defined, okay? They know the needs, they know what product they um, are going to need in eventually. And also they know how much people is um, it's willing to pay or, they can pay, right? Um, also, the promotion. They say, for example, I don't know, they say, a dollar, a dollar, a dollar, right? So it's kind of promotion. It's a way of promoting their product, okay? Uh, there are other kind of um, elements right there, like the place. If they are near the entrance, they are going to sell more. Okay, but if they are kind of far, maybe to the corner, they're going to sell less unless they are near to the bus stop, right? So the place is important. The market is important. The promotion is important. And also the price, okay, the price. And also the product, right? The product has to be the exactly the one that you really need okay in the right moment so time and the right place okay so um, let's think about water water mm -hmm. what brands of water comes come to your mind water water I'm not saying the other word in Spanish. I'm saying water. Water. <laughs> yeah. Uh huh. ¿Qué aguas conocen? Water. Water. Cristal. Cristal. Okay. Alpina. Mm -hmm. Alpina. Mm -hmm. Perlita. 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 Yeah. Uh -huh. Perlita. Which one? Agua pura. Yes, agua pura. Have you seen those in the pink bottle? In the pink uh, big bottle? Oh, es agua pura. No, that one is inmaculada. Have you seen the pink ones? Less in water. <laughs> oh my God, Wilbur. Oh my God. Y para los diablitos aquí, vea. <laughs> Hasta nos roció Wilber ahorita. <laughs> All right, yeah, you're, you're right. Uh -huh. Y de veras, ¿de cuál agua preferirán ellos, verdad? Para hacer esa santificación. Okay, now let's think about the kind of water that can be found, uh, I don't know, in a restaurant. If you order a bottle of water in a restaurant, what kind of water do you think you are going to receive? Si usted va a una... oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> The courtesy, ¿verdad? De cortesía <laughs> de agua del when, filtro. When I... Y sin filtro. <laughs> no filtered. Okay. Uh, the uh -huh. restaurant. Uh, uh -huh. uh, da. No me acuerdo del verbo. 
Which one? Entrega. Which one? I'm sorry? The, the restaurant, entrega. Uh, delivers, brings, gives you. Delivers uh, mm -hmm. uh, a glass. Water on glass. A glass no, of water. A glass of water. Uh, okay. They don't deliver a bottle. But they have it in a in a soda fountain. Okay, so they you can get the water from there. Maybe the same company that offers the sodas, they offer the water. I don't know if they have a manguerita, a hose, right, to filter it. I, I really don't know. It depends. But usually you will receive a good quality water, okay, in a restaurant. Yeah, you are going and you are going to trust that the place where you are acquiring the water, the water will um, guarantee that you will receive a good quality a kind of water. But if you go, but if you go to, um, I don't know, what place, um, comparing, comparing, um, if you go to play football, okay, play, play soccer, and you ask for water, you are a, a soccer player, and you ask for water, what water do you think they are going to offer you? Gatorade. Oh, okay, Gatorade. Uh-huh, that's because your team has money. Yeah, I mean, uh-huh. <laughs> but usually we go to the hose, right? Because in, 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 because in this moment, because I, I am very tired, I, I kind of, which, whichever water, Exactly, exactly. You don't care about where you get the water, but you need to feel this need, okay? And maybe you're exhausted. You really need the water. Yes, you're right. And for example, I didn't like the Alpina water before. Now I like it. But before I thought that it was too salty, that the flavor was like salty and it was different to Cristal. And I could differentiate this, the flavors. Now, ask me, I don't know, because now I pay for it, okay? Before my dad and my mom paid for the water. So I had a choice to, I had a choice between both. So I'd rather, Cristal, okay, drink Cristal instead of, or rather than the uh, Alpina one, because mm, I didn't pay for it. My, my dad, my mom did it. But now that I pay for the water, I don't care which water it is, okay? I just feel the need mm, because of the costs, right? Now, Mm, let's think about another product, cell phones, cell phones. Mm -hmm. Tell me kinds of cell phones that come to your mind. Uh, Google. Okay. Google, mm -hmm. yes. Mm -hmm. uh, Honor. Mm -hmm. Motorola, Apple. Uh, uh, I began to buy a uh, Google for 10 years about because nobody, nobody wanted to buy a uh, Google because uh, it was Chinese product. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But uh, when I went to Tigo, they didn't know. They sell uh, for capacities. Uh, we can say that, uh, mm -hmm. but they didn't know that they have, they have had, or they had no, mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. a, a camera uh, with a, a, a pass mm -hmm. same megapixel with Samsung for 10 years or 12. Mm -hmm. But the difference was when I decide to buy it, I bought it because uh, it was cheap, but they didn't know that they have 
had a, a car size a camera. Oh, okay. Car size is the most important camera uh, uh, lens in the world. Okay. Car size, there are in NASA, they have the lens of NASA. Mm -hmm. All right, this uh, is interesting. For, mm -hmm. uh, 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 what's the name? The, the el aerospacial. The, the uh -huh. what's the name? The I don't know. <laughs> environmental. The the satellites. For the satellites, uh, they have satellites. The satellites. satellites. Mm -hmm. The lens is car size. Come from Germany. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. All right, and so you know that's a very attractive yes. fe feature for uh, you because right. you knew about it. You knew about yeah. it, but people maybe don't know. So it's right. uh, it will be, um, I think, it will be a very good strategy to take that feature and create a promotion strategy for everybody to know that then they will increase their sales. Right? Yeah. So thank you very much, Santiago. Thank you. Yeah. All right, people. Now we are analyzing the way uh, we can get any product according to the needs we have. Because, like, the acquisition power, it's really important. So we are talking about the price, yeah, and the needs, exactly the product we need. And uh, for example, you think, well, I have two products. They are similar. They both fit the need that I have, but one is cheaper than the other. Okay. And then you are going to decide. Then you have to get the choice. Hmm. Also, maybe you don't know about the features or the functions of a product. But when you go to the store where the product is available and you can touch it and you can test it or try it, then you are going to get acknowledged that about that feature that you really needed. And it's more attractive than the other that you were looking for. So you decide for the other that they promoted to you. Um, this is the way that the marketing works. The marketing works with concepts, okay? It worked with concepts. Uh, you have to develop a good concept of the product. You have to make uh, people know about these concepts and you have to create a concept. You have also to have this in two ways because you need the feedback, what the people really is um, saying about my product. And I can get that in Zoom to create or to maintain or to keep, to renew my strategies, okay? This is to keep my place in the market, we have a spot. We got a spot in the market. So now we need to maintain our product in that market, market making profits. So pricing, uh, pricing the product is really important and also the product itself, but also that people know about my product and know about my price that I am offering, okay? My pricing strategy also, uh, the place, yeah, where you can get my product, you can purchase my product. So this is what we are analyzing at this moment. Now, let's go to see some other definition. I mean, this other definition of marketing. And let's try to figure out what elements are involved here about the 4P, the four okay? Um, yeah, this was, what elements are involved in these, 
definition of marketing. No. Okay. Let's no. read. Who wants to read the first definition? Each and every one of the activities a company undertakes to promote the buying or selling of a product or service. Very good. So each and every one, one. of the activities, okay? Activities. Now we say the company undertakes to what? To promote. promote. Mm -hmm. so the buying or selling the buying or selling because i need customers and i need distributors okay i need customers and i need distributors that's why i say buying or selling of a product or service what elements are involved in this um, definition of marketing elements For example, product. Product. Selling. Mm -hmm. selling. Mm -hmm. The price, yeah. Mm -hmm. Service. The product or service is product, product is an object and service is intangible, product. but it is a product too, right? But it is intangible. Mm -hmm. The activity of company is a place. Exactly. Activities okay. mm -hmm. of a company is a place. And to promote is the the the, the promotion. Uh -huh. Yes, promotion, like communication, promotion. right? Communication, communication right. publication, right? Yes. So we say that in the definition of marketing, we have the four elements of the marketing mix. Okay, of the marketing mix. So the marketing processes or the marketing strategies are phased to or destined destined destinated yeah destinated to um promote right the price of a product or a service and the way it is available for the customer the consumer or the distributors okay because this is as if i am an, if i am a producer or if I am an importer, right? Now, let's see about the next one. The next one. It says... Who wants to read it? Number two. Meeting needs profitable. Profitable. No. Profitable. <laughs> yeah. Profitable. Okay. Bleed, bleed. Uh -huh. ah, bleed. Prof prof Profitably. Tably. Ah, te. Ah, the no, 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 no. Ta, ta, ta. Yeah. Ta. Meeting this pro profitably. No, no, no. Wait, wait. Va, sería profitably. Again, ah, profitably. Profi no, no. Profitably. Pro profi profitably. Yes. Profitably. Profi Profitable. Yes. Profitably. 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 Yes. Okay. Because Profitably. Uh, we are used to use the, the, the word profitable like this. Profitable. Yeah. Pero esto es que genera ganancias. Ahora, eh, que genere ganancias ya de una manera o en la manera que genere ganancias ya sería profitably. Bli. Not bull, but yeah. lee. Okay. Yeah, for me, this is very because you say able, you say comfortable, and I <laughs> I I didn't okay. Yes. Okay. okay. Uh -huh. the, the um, stress of this word isn't fee. Fatable. Freedably. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay then, but this takes us to Let's say in, in the promotion, we are going to find flyers, printings, logos, concepts, communication, 
publication of what? Of my business, of the object of my business. And what is the object of my business? My product or my service, okay? My product or my service. And in the concept, I have also the price, okay? The price. Now, let's think that in a marketing plan, okay, a marketing plan, it's oh. in a business plan, okay? It's part of the business plan. The, the business plan is everything we do, okay? Everything we do in order to produce, to sell, to buy, okay? Uh, our product or our service to customers to fit needs, etc. So we need to have a business plan with a very good marketing plan, with a very good marketing plan. Okay, now let's go and see, let's revise these uh, definitions, okay, because the marketing mix can be divided into four groups of variables commonly known as the four P's product price, place, and promotion. And place is also known like the distribution. That's why we say activities, not only the physical place, but activities of taking the product to the customer. Um, this is like the approach to customers with my product. Now, match the four P's to their descriptions. And let's say number one, number two, number three, number four, the four P's. Okay, now let's match we, each one with the definition. I will mute myself and you are going to comment this. Okay, you are going to comment this. A ver, tomen ustedes la iniciativa, yo me pongo en silencio y ustedes hacen acá el match. Okay, vamos. Hey, people, todos comentando, vamos. Okay, uh, product, uh, I think, is the merchandise or service offered by a company or its customer. It's the number one, the last sentence, I think. What do you think, people? Price. Yes, I think so. Is the amount of money paid by ne, customers. Ne, that's this price. That's his price, the amount. Amount is quantity price is the amount of money. Of money. Yeah. I said that. It's price, right. Yes, Kevin, correct. Yeah, like that communicate made product features. The activity that communicate. That is promotion. The product. The activities that yeah. make the it's product a of a lot of consumer is promotion. promotion. Yes. It's the promotion, the activities. Promotion. That make the product available to consumers, right. Yeah, the four is the place, the... The three. The three, the place is the... Number three. Yes. Okay, thank you yes. very much, guys. Now, please, Edwin, read product and its definition. Uh, product, the merchandising of or service offered by a company to its customers. Very good, thank you. Now, let's refine this pronunciation, okay? Product is the merchandise, the, the merchandise, merchandise, the merchandise, or services, or, services 
or services, or services offered, offered, offered by a by company, a company to, to its customers. customers. To its customers. Okay. So now, number two, please, Hosman. Price. The amount of money paid by customer to purchase the product. Very good. Let's refine the pronunciation to purchase. To purchase. To purchase. Mm -hmm. to purchase. purchase. Yes. So let's read it together again. Price is the amount of money. The amount of money. The amount of money. Paid amount by of customers. To purchase. Paid by to customers. To purchase the product. Purchase the product. Very good. Very good. So now number three, please. Um, let's see. Mr. Alvaro. Me? Oh, okay, Boris. Okay. And you're going to yeah. say place, Boris. And place. Alvaro will say promotion. Okay. okay. Place mm -hmm. is the activities. Is the activities that make the product available to customer. All right, very good. So place. Play is the activities uh -huh. that make that the make... product available to product. Okay, let's refine this pronunciation. Oh, sorry. Available. Relajemos un poquito, relajemos y digamos available. 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 Yeah. Available. Relaxing. Okay. The activities that make the product available to consumers. Consumers. No, no. Consumers. Aquí va el estrés, miren. Consumers. 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 Yes. Consumers. Consumers. So the activities that make the product available to consumers. To consumers. Customers is different. Consumers. Consumers. Is pronounced different. All right. Now promotion, Albert, please. The activities that communicate the products, future, and benefits that a help pursue cost customer to purchase the product. All right, very good. Now let's refine this word features. Features. Fe no, no, few. Uh, fe mm -hmm. fe 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 features. Features. Mm -hmm. Features. Features. Yeah. Pero aquí es una ch pronunciada, mm -hmm. sí. Features. Features. Ajá, no shures, sino que chures. Features. Chu, chu, chu. Features. Exacto. Hágalo fuerte como una ch, no como una sh, sino que ah, fi features. Features. Yes, correct. Mm -hmm. That's right. Very good. So now we say persuade. Features. Persuade. Exactly. Exactly. How do you say per persuade? That persuade. correctly. Persuade. 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 Persuade, persuade. persuade. Mm -hmm. persuade okay. customers. Ajá. Uh -huh. Miren, aquí ya suena diferente. Customers. Aquí es consumers. consumers. Exactly. To purchase the product. Now, we are going to read them all together, okay? Number one, the activities that make the product available to consumer is the place. This way, okay? Bye. Así lo vamos a leer. Vamos a decir la definición y vamos a decir is. Y luego el nombre de la estrategia, okay? Vamos a ver. The first one, the activities, the activities that, make that make the product available, available to customers, consumers, to consumers, to consumers, consumers. to consumers, uh -huh. to consumers. Yes. What is that? The place. The place. All uh, right, is place. Now, 
Next one. Mm -hmm. The activities that communicate the product future futures. Future. Future. And features. benefits features. Features. and benefits that help persuade 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 customer to purchase the product. Purchase the product. Purchase the product. Very good. Relajemos un poquito. Ajá. Relajemos un poquito. Nuestra lengua. Para que, por ejemplo, communicate, miren, communicate, communicate, com ahí va el estrés. Ajá, communicate. no communicate, no communicate, sino que communicate. Communicate, communicate. Okay, this is promotion, okay, this is promotion. It's promotion. Yes, next. Everybody, the amount, the amount of money, of money, money paid by, by customers, customers to purchase, to purchase the product is price. Price is the price. All right, the last one. The merchandise, the merchandise or service merchandise offered, offered by, by a company, company to, to its customers. customers. All right. Mm -hmm. Very good. It's product. The number one. The product. Yes. Uh huh. And not only a product, but a service too. Okay. But a service right. too. Okay. Allow me to go to the next part of this activity and I will show you some flashcards as the ones that I show you in the last time. Uh, that I show you the flashcards. Remember with the PLC, now we are going to do this with the marketing mix. So what is the marketing mix? Well, it's the correct combination, okay? Right combination of the four Ps. What are the four Ps? Product, price, place, promotion. Very good. Okay, I'll let me to show you this and we'll... That's the marketing mix, no? That's the, the marketing mix. Yeah, okay. The four P's. Mm -hmm. Right, the four, four P's. P's. Mm -hmm. So here we've got the uh, definitions and you're going to say what it's requesting, okay? So now let's, we're going to going back, okay? So this is eight by eight. I don't remember if it goes right there or right there. The activities that communicate the product's features and benefits that help persuade customers to purchase the product. Mm -hmm. ¿Cuál sería promotion? la palabra? Which is the promotion. promotion? Very good. To communicate is the key word, right? To communicate is the key word. So, okay, we finished. <laughs> Let's go back. Let's go back. Mm -hmm. So here we go. Mm -hmm. Marketing mix. Can you define the marketing mix? What's the marketing it's, mix? It's a product uh, with uh, an accessible price in a uh, Correct place uh, with uh, the promotion can uh, uh, que permita llegar al cliente. <laughs> okay, uh -huh. to allow or to uh, reach the client. Okay. All right. Now, I'm um, sorry. The marketing mix. Let's. Read it like this, and let's try to say it like this as in the manual we've got it in the conversation. It's about putting the right product in the right place and time with the right promotion and at the right price. Okay, vamos a ver. What is the marketing mix? It's about putting the right product in the right place and time with the right promotion and the right price. Very good, Kevin. Yes. 
And thank you, Lorena, too. So let's look. What are the, I mean, what does the four P's stand for? P is for product, P is for place, P <laughs> is for promotion, P is for price. Very good. So the order, well, actually product and price goes together and place and promotion goes together too. So let's say product, price, place, promotion. Everybody, product, price, place, promotion. Product, price, product, place, price, promotion. promotion. Yes, product, product and price, price place, promotion. place, and promotion. Yes, product, price, place, promotion. Those are the four product, P's price, of the marketing place, mix. Promotion. Yes. What are the four P's of the marketing mix? Product, price, place, promotion. Now, what are the four P's of the marketing peaks? Uh, peaks. <laughs> Mix. Product, price, place, promotion. Very good, very good. So now let's see. What do you think target market is? Target market. It's a specific segment to the client. Okay. Mm -hmm. Specific that, uh, segment that, of uh, client. Uh, they can offer the product. Uh, they can offer, uh, the company offers the product to this segment. Okay. Mm -hmm. Very good. They have similar characteristics, right? They have similar needs. And in these characteristics is the, as uh, Alvaro said, right? The power of purchasing, okay? The purchase power. So let's read. A set of buyers sharing common needs or characteristics mm -hmm. that the company decides to serve or satisfy with a product. Easy, right? Mm -hmm, teacher. Okay, what is the target market? A set, a ver todos. A set of a set. common needs of characteristics that, that the companies decide to serve or satisfy with a product. Very good, very good. Very nice. Now, what is target your market? Target your market. Ideas? Ideas? Maybe the kind of the product that I can buy. Okay. Maybe you are thinking something, but maybe you are not using the right words. I know that you know what target your market is, Lorena, because I think you do it in your company a time after time, all right? So target your market is to define who you are selling to, okay? The people that you want to reach or to you want to get with your product. So define who you are selling to and figure out what they want or need. Pongamos en orden esta definición en nuestra mente, okay? Target your market is to define who you are selling to and figure out what they want or need, okay? What does target your market mean, guys? Define who, define who you are selling to and figure out what they want or, or need. Very good. Aquí estamos diciendo definir a quién. Por eso dice aquí selling to. No dice to sell, ¿verdad? Dice selling to. A quién le está vendiendo. Who? You are selling to. ¿A quién? Este A se pone al final después del verbo. Pero significa que va con este who. ¿ya? ¿A quién usted le está vendiendo? 
okay? Who you are selling to. Luego tenemos que tener, definir o descubrir cuáles son los deseos o las necesidades de estas personas. ¿Qué es lo que ellos quieren o qué es lo que necesitan? So let's say this in order. What does target your market mean? To define who you are selling to and figure out what they want or need. A ver, vamos a ver ustedes solitos. A ver, define. Define who you are selling to and figure out what they want or need. Very good. Mm -hmm. Now, let's define what is product. What is product? Let's define what product is. What is a product? Ya lo vimos por allá en el manual. Pongamos en orden así las palabras. Product. It's a um, merchandise or service operator. Exactly, okay. Merchandise or services offered by a company to its customer. Okay, so what is product? Again, again, again. What is product, guys? Hey, people. Uh huh. No puede ser que ya se me durmieron, chicos. No, no me dejen solita. ¿Habré apagado el micrófono? No. <laughs> okay, what is product? Merchandise or, or service or offered service. by a company to its customers. Okay, y está en plural, ¿verdad? Services. Service. Services. Yes, services. Uh -huh. Y aquí pronunciamos con una letra D. Offered. Offered. Sí. Offered. Porque termina en una letra con voiced sound. Okay? Offered. Que necesitamos esa de. Offered by a company to its customers. Okay, now let's see what is price. What is price? A definition. Is a cause the, the product. Uh, mm -hmm. what uh, people uh, will rather uh, pay. Pay for my product, okay? Yes, so, uh -huh. exactly, go ahead, Lorena, go ahead. Is the amount of money exchanged for a good or service? Very good, exchanged. Exchange because it's not only money that we ex exchange, right? It's not only money. Uh, the price could be in cambalaches, right? In cambalaches is not money. Yeah, you exchange. But yes, you give money, they give you a product. Okay, that's the exchange. Uh, now, next, place. Place. Can you define place in the marketing mix? Solo uno, por favor, no, no, no se me amontonen. No. <laughs> the activities that make the product available to consumers. Very good. Aha, uh -huh. the activities that make the product available to consumers. Consumers, very good. 
Now, activities because it includes the distribution, okay, or the delivery of the product. What about promotion? Let's go back to promotion. To blah, blah, blah. Um, the activities that com communicate the product features and benefit helps. I don't remember. <laughs> okay, good. Very good. Yeah, the activities that communicate, communicate the product's features, features and benefits that help persuade customers to purchase the product. Okay, then communication is the key here. Promotion, communication. Promotion to communicate, okay? And it helps to persuade customers to purchase my product. All right, people. So I think we finished. And yay, we finished the eight uh, um, flashcards. All right, now. Les voy a pasar el link y ustedes pueden jugar también con eh, las otras formas de aprendizaje. Acuérdense que aquí podemos aprender en esta aplicación, podemos aprender tanto escritura, miren, ahí oh. les da eso en multiple choice, podemos eh, hacer test, combinar las actividades, ¿verdad? A manera de... Saber cómo definir estas palabras, ¿sí? Acordemos que estamos haciendo vocabulary y esta aplicación es buenísima okay, para aprender vocabulario. vocabulario. Ok, ya les vamos a pasar ahí por ahí el... A ver si les da por aquí. Para que ustedes después eh, puedan ustedes jugar, accesar ahí. Eh, ahí se los pasé. Bien, la última cosa que vamos a ver el día de hoy es esta conversación que teníamos eh, el día de ayer. ¿Okay? Esta conversación que teníamos el día de ayer acerca de eh, Tim, y Indiana, Tim y Diana que están en una como entrevista, ¿verdad? Entonces vamos a leer por acá la eh, la conversación cita mi hija me molesta porque dice mamá dice por qué les dice conversación cita se llama conversación dice. <ríe> Ajá. pero es cortita es cortita And here we go A ver, Boris and Lorena, please. Eh, Boris Tim y Lorena Ana. Okay. Okay. Uh, Tim. Oh. Excuse me. Uh, sorry. I am. Um, uh, Let's start with the most important part of the interview. Here's the first question. What are the key elements that guarantee the success of the marketing mix? I think you have to target your market. That is, you must define who you are selling to and you need to figure it out what they want. If you don't do this, your business will inevitable, inevitable fall. Bleed, bleed. Inevi inevitably. It's inevitable. Inevitably. Inevitable. inevitable. No, no. Eh, les muestro las dos palabras. Está inevitable. Eh, I'm sorry. Inevitable. 
y está inevitably. En este caso Inevitable. estamos diciendo de manera inevitable, ¿verdad? O inevitablemente. ¿Ok? Ajá. Vamos. That's right. Target your market and be sure to understand the first piece. Now, second question, how will you define the marketing mix? Marketing mix. Well, to put in Pelly, the marketing mix is about putting the right product in the right place in time with the right promotion and at the right price. To do this well, you need to know every aspect of your business plan. Very good. Thank you very much. Entonces vemos acá que tenemos business plan y tenemos business marketing plan. mix. A ver, ¿qué dijimos que era el marketing mix? Lo que acá sí, dice, es, ¿verdad? Es yes. uh -huh. Ok. Esta combinación de, eh, que hacemos del producto, del precio, del place, uh, del lugar, perdón, de la promoción o de la comunicación, estamos hablando de nuestro marketing plan. Ok. Entonces tenemos marketing plan in our business plan. Okay. Marketing plan and the business plan. Y decíamos que solamente es una de las partes importantes, ¿verdad? Pero en realidad viene a convertirse en la vértebra. Bien, ahora veamos en nuestro manual, a ver si se puede ver aquí, se mira. No sé si ha quedado pausado. ¿Sí se ve el manual? Sí. Yes. Ok, ahí tenemos eh, tres preguntitas. What does target your market mean? What does target your market mean? A ver, who remembers? Mm. Mm -hmm. It's a strategy, a strategy mm -hmm. or activities mm -hmm. or the, the, or the Sales. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, sales. but target your market. Target your market means that you have to define okay. the people that I want to sell. Exactly, who you are selling to. Who you are selling to. Mm -hmm. Pero también tengo que encontrar o tengo que eh, descubrir por eso uso el verbo figure Sorry. out figure Sorry. out Sorry. what they want le vamos a poner un, una coma acá and figure out what they want mm -hmm. customers or need Ok. They es el who, ¿verdad? El who que estamos buscando acá. Define who you are selling to and figure out what they want or need. They are the customers or the consumers. Are the who we are targeting. Ok, now, number two. What does each of the four P's stand for? Mm -hmm. Acordémonos cuáles van juntas. Product price. Yes. Place and promotion. Very good. Place and promotion. Very good. So P is for product, P is for price, P is for place, and P is for promotion. Very good. Now, number three, how would you describe the term marketing mix? How would you describe the term marketing mix? A ver, nos están preguntando how would you describe, ¿ok? How would you describe? Vaya, aquí voy a hacer una aclaración. Normalmente, cuando nos dicen how would you describe en un, en un contexto así, no me están preguntando mi opinión exactamente, sino que en general. Así como, por ejemplo, usted me pregunta, how do you say ventana en English? No es como yo lo digo, sino que cómo se dice, ¿verdad? 
Sin embargo, preguntamos, how do you say? Uh, por ejemplo, podemos decir, how do you eat, mm, I don't know, eh, en general, ¿verdad? How do you consider eh, the dinner food? Okay, the dinner food in El Salvador. How do you consider? No, como, eh, no es como yo lo considero, sino que como se considera en general. Okay, así que no necesariamente este you se, se refiere a solo a, a usted personalmente. Entonces, how would you describe the term marketing mix? Y nos vamos a lo que aprendemos. Marketing, marketing mix is the putting the right. Eh, 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 Price, a product in the uh, right price, uh, in the right place, uh, with the right promotion. Mm -hmm. Entonces sería in the right place and the product, time. The uh -huh. right, yeah, yeah. The product. Mm -hmm. Vale, las preposiciones, las preposiciones, uh -huh. pongámosle cuidado a las preposiciones. In the right place and time, and ¿ok? Time, right. Ajá, pero para decir que lo vamos a poner con la debida comunicación o promoción, ¿verdad? Entonces with, sería with, with, with the right price. With the right promotion, ¿ok? Promotion, with the right, ajá, promotion. At, at, at the right, at the right like uh, price, okay? Okay. At, entonces las preposiciones son muy importantes para darle el sentido correcto, ¿verdad? Right. Putting the right product in the right place and time with the right promotion at the right price, okay? At the right price. Okay, people. All right, then. Mm -hmm. I think we have come, I mean, uh, understood the four P's of the marketing mix, right? Then we have these uh, things to classify, okay? You have to classify the words right under each strategy, okay? After each, um, under each strategy. For example, for product of these words, product, Mm -hmm. Design, mm -hmm. design. Mm -hmm. You can put brand name. Mm -hmm. Packaging, packaging. Mm -hmm. packaging. 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 And you can put to uh, inventory. No, no, no. Inventory. It's place. That is place. Okay. okay. Inventory is place. Mm -hmm. eh, mm. Okay, veamos la siguiente. Yeah. Brown name? Ya está ahí. Price? Price? Discount? Is correct. Payment plans? Mm -hmm. Credit terms? Credit terms? A retail, retail, uh, retail price, right. Okay. okay, what about place? The inventory, what he said. Retail collect uh, location. No? Retail location. Personal selling or selling. Or transportation. Selling. Hmm? Delivery. Mm -hmm. Okay, what about promotion? Public relation. Personal selling. Okay. Public, public, public relations. relations. Public okay. relations. Yeah. Relation. Public relations. Personal advertising. selling. Advertising, correct. It's correct. Advertising. Personal selling. Digital marketing. Mm 
Okay, very good, very good. Quitamos entonces de the place. Even though selling presently, it's going to be a way to deliver the, the product to, to a customer, right? So we can leave it right there. But I think it's best for a promotion. All right, people. So uh, is there any questions so far? Are we okay at the moment? Yes, we are. Okay, then. I will call the roll in a very quick way, okay? So say present to everybody when I call your name. Alvaro Ernesto Aguilar Peñate. Ana Lorena Lobato Orellana. Present. Boris Alexander Cortez Cáceres. Present. Okay, so I'm going to do a parenthesis. Please turn your cameras on. Carlos Alberto Dominguez Martinez. Present. Carlos Ernesto Hernández Cepeda. Edwin Antonio Quintero Sumaña. Buenas tardes. Elías Neftalí Martínez González. Present. Eulice Torres Torres. Sir Eulice. Fátima Noemí Umaña Castro. Jose Miguel Torres Hernández. Present teacher. Okay. Jose Salvador Bernal Quintanilla. Josman Atilio Serrano. Present teacher. Karen Iset Sánchez Castro. Kevin Alfredo Lucero Menéndez. Present teacher. Nelson Alberto Peraza Mejía. Rafael Alexander Serna Díaz. Santiago, ok. Santiago Roberto Calderona Velar. Buenas ahí. Ok. Wilber Alberto Pérez Méndez. Present. Ok, people. Miren, yo solo los quiero animar a que no falten a la clase, ¿verdad? Porque acuérdense que estar en la clase pues implica también participar, ¿verdad? Yo sé que están eh, muchos todavía en su trabajo, pero... Eh, lo, les aconsejo mucho que estén presentes, conectados, pero que después vean el video para eh, tener presente y no les quede ninguna laguna en medio por ahí, que queden nadando, ¿verdad? No, hay que ponerse al día para que podamos ir llenando esos gaps que quedan, ¿verdad? Entre uno y otro concepto. Y acuérdense que acá no es una clase de mercadeo, ¿verdad? No es una clase técnica. <risa> Esta es una clase de inglés para el trabajo, ¿ok? Entonces aquí pues no somos expertos, bueno, algunos sí lo son, ¿verdad? Pero eh, no somos, no vamos a impartir ¿Usted? un diplomado de mercadeo, claro. <risa> un diplomado de mercadeo no lo vamos a impartir ahorita aquí en inglés, ¿verdad? Pero sí es toda la base, prácticamente ustedes van a hacer el diplomado de mercadeo, de accounting, de eh, human resources, eh, management, en todo eso, ¿verdad? Pero... Super shame. Pero lo que yo necesito es animarlos y decirles, muchos tal vez se desaniman porque los términos son bastante complejos debido a que no es su área, ¿verdad? De trabajo. Pero eso eh, yo quiero salvarlo, digamos, en el sentido de que esta es una clase de vocabulario de cómo usar el lenguaje, ¿verdad? Es cómo aplicar el lenguaje, cómo entender lo que me dicen en mi trabajo acerca de las actividades normales que atañen a una compañía. Así que quiero animarlos, por favor, vuelvan a ver los videos en las partes en donde se han quedado un poco eh, faltos que usted considere, ¿verdad? Y con mucho gusto pueden hacer las preguntas necesarias. Siéntanse en confianza, por favor, porque la idea es aprender. El objetivo es ser su apoyo. No es ponchármelos. Aquí yo no me los quiero ponchar. Aquí yo necesito que ustedes le echen ganas. Así como yo pongo mi 20%, no, yo pongo mi 100%, pero ustedes ponen el otro 80%, no, ustedes ponen otro 100%, ¿ok? Pero en, juntos hacemos el 100%, ¿verdad? Así que hacemos un 200%. El 100 de ustedes más el 100 mío, 80, 20. Ya hacemos un gran, eh, un gran eh, porcentaje de aprendizaje. Sinergismo, sinergismo. Exactamente, exactamente. Sinergismo. Vamos todos proveyéndonos, ¿verdad? Y es un teamwork. Si usted sabe algo que su compañero preguntó, por favor, 
eh, apoyen, ¿verdad? En esa eh, respuesta a través del WhatsApp. Si alguien pregunta, eh, miren, ¿y qué significaba tal cosa? Ok, pongamos ahí, porque esa es otra estrategia en que se nos va a quedar más si usted le enseña a otra persona lo que usted aprendió. Así que quiero animarlos. No falten de aquí para allá. Procuren sí. estar en las clases participando. Dígame, Álvaro. No me escuché en la, en la lista. No se escuchó en la lista. Vamos a ver, don Álvaro, a ver si le puse. No, mire, como no, así le puse, Álvaro. Ok. Ah, ok, perfecto. Ajá, muy bien, muy bien. Ahí estamos ya. Ok, people. La sesión uno a uno le tocaba ayer a Neftali, a Elías. No sé si hoy quiere quedarse, Elías, o le seguimos cediendo el cupo a otra persona. Sí, you tomorrow. Ok, yes, sí, para otra persona. A otra see persona. Ah, ok. Sí. See you, see you, see you tomorrow. Um, bye, bye. ¿Alguien quiere quedarse? Night, todo va huyendo, todo va huyendo cobardemente, ¿no? <laughs> no, it's ok. I understand. I understand. All right, people. See you. Have a very good night. Bye bye. Okay, goodbye, Karen, and goodbye, Carlos Ernesto. See you tomorrow.